The Navy interred the remains of two unknown sailors from the Civil War ironclad USS Monitor in Arlington National Cemetery March 8th. Monitor was lost in a storm off of Cape Hatteras, North Carolina, December 31, 1862. It was discovered in 1974 and was designated the nation's first National Marine Sanctuary. The remains were recovered from the sunken Monitor during a 2002 expedition to recover the turret from the Revolutionary ship. Monitor, the Union's first ironclad vessel, is famous for its battle with the Confederate ironclad CSS Virginia and the Battle of Hampton Roads. Extensive efforts were made by the Joint POW-MIA Accounting Command to identify the sailors. Possible descendants of 30 family members from 10 different families identified by JPAC were invited to attend the ceremony. The remains were transferred from JPAC in Hawaii to Dulles International Airport March 7th for the interment ceremony March 8th. However, having raised those remains, we brought them here to the National Military Cemetery founded during the same great conflict for which they gave, in President Lincoln's words, their last full measure of devotion. Following the chapel service, the remains were carried by caisson to the gravesite where they were interred with full military honors. Members of the public were on hand to witness the interment, as well as many Civil War reenactors who wished to pay their respects to the unknown sailors. The unknown sailors and 14 other crew members who perished when the monitor sank will be memorialized on a group marker in section 46 of the cemetery. Should you pay that last full measure of devotion, we're going to bring you home and we're going to try to find the best appropriate, uh, dignified uh, final resting place, even if it takes a century and a half. From the Defense Media Activity, I'm Petty Officer Joshua Shepard.